guys, Rachel CPR here. Today I wanted to share with you some of the Bolero products that I got from the Dollar Tree. I've never had the opportunity to get them before because I'm not sure if I was just overlooking them or if it's, I don't know, or if my Dollar Tree just got them in and so now I got them, I don't know. But I usually go to, from Dollar Tree to Dollar Tree. I've never actually seen them before, but I've been watching a lot of different reviews on the Bolero products. They're a natural product and they're very, <clears throat> I'm sorry, everyone in my house is sick right now, literally. We have been down and out for entirely too long, so forgive me if my voice goes in and out. But anyway, like I was saying, the Bolero products I have been looking for, and I usually use a lot of makeup wipes. And so when I went in and I found the makeup wipes, I was really happy. There are 30 in each one of the packages. This one is the... Let's see, mango orange blossom. These smell so good. And then I have the coconut sea salt. This one is argan shea butter. And I believe the rest of them are all duplicates. Yep, the rest of them are all duplicates. So the wipes themselves are pretty thin, which I do like that about them because I find that when I am using these, I like to have something really thin that I can wrap around my hand if I'm just like brushing something outside. But the reason why I was really interested in the, the makeup wipes is because I go through so many makeup wipes. I just finished off my Oil of Olay makeup remover wipes and I use these on my skin. They have they don't have any kind of a scent or anything like that. I was nervous about using these on my face because of the scent, but I use a lot of wipes to clean my brushes. When I'm spot cleaning my brushes, I like to use a nice cleansing cloth. And what it does is it will definitely wet the brush, not completely. And this is not in replacement of deep cleaning my brushes, but just so that I don't have to wet them completely every single time I use them, I will go over my cleansing cloth and this is I've already done this one so it's not really showing anything on here but um, I will go over on this cleansing cloth and I'll use it for all of my brushes and you'll just I'll just flip it over and it will just take off all of the makeup that is on the brush and I love that because when when I purchased the It Cosmetic Velvet Luxe, Luxe Foundation Brush from Ulta, the guy told me that I really shouldn't re-wet completely my brush too often because the brushes, the bristles are so tight together. He says you don't want to end up with a problem if it doesn't dry properly. And so he said spot cleaning is really important or using a brush spray. But what I like about using the wipes is right now to the touch, this is a little bit moist. But in about two to three minutes, this is going to be completely dry and ready to go away without any bacteria growing inside of it. So I really like that. And I was so happy that I was able to find the wipes. And then I was also able to get the mango orange blossom bath soak. And I don't use these for my bath. I use these for when I do, um, if I do a pedicure at home, I'll put these in my water. Or even if I don't do a pedicure, if I just do a bath soak at home in my tub to maintain a pedicure, I will put my salts in the water. Along with that, I also got the bath fizzers. And there were four of them in the store. This one is the coconut chamomile, lavender vanilla, rosemary mint. I can't wait to use that one. <laughs> and this is the oatmeal shea. And I haven't opened any of these yet, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to break them into quarters because again, this is going to be used in my foot bath. So I'm not gonna need a, a full block for each one. And we were, my daughter and I were actually waiting for the bath fizzies to be released at um, Bath and Body Works. And we were gonna go and get some, but when I saw this, I said, oh, we can get four of these out of one. So that's like 25 cents for each one of the bath bombs for our foot spa. So that's very good. I also purchased the Face, Skin, and Hair Body Oil Mango Orange Blossom, and that's what this looks like. It's no longer in here. I already took it out, and I believe it's in my purse. Yes, I think it's in my purse. And the main ingredient in this is mineral oil, so it's definitely not something that I would use in my hair. 
I just liked it for a nice light scent for something just to have in my purse where you're not offensive, where you have like a really big fragrance on as much as just a little light scent that you have, that you can have in your purse. And the last things that I purchased from this line were the moisturizing body creams and I got them in the mango orange blossom because again that was a scent that I really liked. I purchased one the first time and let me take my rings off and I really really liked it. I didn't think it would be so moisturizing but then once I got home and used it and I definitely I only opened mine a teeny tiny bit because the consistency is not very thick and so I didn't want it to be too much when it comes out but it smells oh it smells so good it kind of smells like um not kind of it definitely smells like uh what are those fuzzy pop rocks that's what the mango orange blossom smells like it smells like pop rocks especially these things right here when you open it literally it just smells like pop rocks oh it smells so good it smells really sweet and fun so those are the things I got from Bolero. I am absolutely in love with them. I didn't get any of the shower gel because I have tons of shower gel. So I didn't get those. And the other thing that I got was the facial scrubbies. And I'm in love with these things. When I don't want to use my electric cleanser for my skin, I use these right here and they really do a nice deep cleaning for my skin, like taking off my makeup. But then because they're silicone, it is so nice and gentle on the skin. But I actually bought this, uh, this pack, this new pack. I bought one for myself, one for my daughter, but then I bought a new pack because the way these are designed, there is a little handle on the back and I put it like this on my palm and then I'm able to clean my makeup brushes very easily right on here and it just foams up and you use very little product when you are doing it that way. So yes, these are a definite love for me from the Dollar Tree and that's it. So thank you so much for joining me today and I will see you again very shortly. Bye guys.